see in that color. Mm -hmm. My lip too big for that. My lip too big for that. You see my lip? No, 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 no. I, I don't really wear lipstick and thing, you know. I, I, my lip too big for that. My lip just, mm -mm. my lip too big for that. I don't, I see, I don't wear lipstick and, and what I'm saying. You see, when I wear lipstick, I just look dead, dead, dead. And I, I don't like that. I don't like that. Yeah, I don't even wear lipstick, you know. I just, just wear like bronzy colors and like a little, you know, a little gloss and thing. You know, I find my lip. I find I just look like a clown when I put on lipstick because my lips is too big and I doesn't like I don't even want to put on lip liner and thing, you know. Oh god, you see my lip? My lip girl, I don't wear lipstick and thing. I find I find when you look big you just put on a little gloss or do it from butter. Do it from butter. Just go inside without lipstick. Don't, don't even put on anything because your lips so big. And I find my lip just look like if I put on a color on my eye and then I put a color on my lip. I mean, I just look like frosty. I mean, I don't know. I don't know what to do. What What should I put on my lip? Because I find my lip just too big. Why? 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 I know you guys might be laughing at what I've just said, but in reality, it's all too true. And frankly at one point in time I thought too that my lips were too big and today I'm really just here to tell you all that it's not too big and it's time that we start to embrace you know what we have I mean God made us in his image and likeness and he wouldn't have made us this way if he didn't want us to look like this not so and I mean a lot of women will come into the store a lot of people will you know tell me when they when I'm doing their makeup they don't want this particular color or they don't want you know something too bright because the lips too big and I mean your lips are not too big I mean I could understand if you don't want I mean I'm not into forcing people to do you know try things that they don't want to but in reality you can try you know a brighter color or like a red or burgundy without it having looking like too much you know when i was in primary school i used to do like this to smile i used to actually do that i mean i think it's something that society kind of conditioned us well in the past that you know big lips because i people used to call me lip tone in primary school that was like the biggest joke ever look lip tone reach and i used to be like you know and now my lips has its own personality like i'll be sleeping and i don't even know what my lips doing that's the tell you like <laughs> i really don't gosh i'm joking but you know everybody now is like you have beautiful lips everybody want big lips people just pay for this and you don't want it let's let's think about that so i'm gonna show you today how to line your lips and also I'm going to be wearing a very bright pink lipstick. It's called Fusion Pink. Well, it's a mix of red and pink. It's one of Mark's new lipsticks from the Four Color Collection. And, uh, yeah, you can get away with it. If I can get away with it, trust me, you can get away with it. And that's, as I was saying before, you don't have to wear the brightest color. You can try something at home, see how you feel about it. And, you know, try and kind of condition yourself to to get accustomed to it start to embrace your beauty because this is how you were made so let's get into it hey so i'm not wearing much makeup today um i'm gonna be doing a bright lip for work and i'm gonna be using a fusion pink lipstick as i said before and it looks like that still working on some kinks in my camera focus it and stuff and i'm gonna be lining with a red lip liner and this liner is from somebody called soft temptation i don't know but i love this liner i already moisturized my lip with lip conditioner so always always make sure to moisturize the lip face so the lip liner glides on smoothly lipstick everything glides on smoothly and i'm going to be using um a mixture of two glosses one from milani and the other from mac right so we're going to add some dimension to the lip after so i'm going to be looking in a mirror so if you kind of see me looking well you wouldn't see me looking down anyway all right so you're starting from the very edge and you are starting to line the lip right okay. 
and you know there's a thing where people who kind of um nothing is wrong with this eh? but they kind of contour the like bigger lips to make it look smaller and when i first started to like go to a makeup class um they used to contour my lips so they used to basically cut off this entire piece and frankly this is just me eh? i know it can be done i didn't like it i was like okay there's clearly lip under there come on so they used to put the liner on top i'm lining my whole lip right nobody ain't getting life out in this dance right so then you're lining from the top you want to start from the this edge here and go up right you i always tell people don't try to just do everything at once do it in steps And I always, I don't leave my lip liner like that. You need to blend your lip liner and you can use your very same pencil to blend it. This makes the color look fused into the lipstick rather than a line of lip liner and then you just put the lipstick inside of it and what you can do also to help your lipstick stay on longer apply the lip liner over the entire lip cool cool man all right so now for some fusion pink i love this lipstick ah bright I'm using the tip to get in there. Now for some lip gloss. I am using, I don't know where this is from. My sister gave this to me. This is from probably one of Mac's collections. Need a lip brush. So we're just gonna add some of that to the center. And then we can add a little bit of the Milani. Very little bit because it's kind of a golden color. I'm sure you'll be able to see that on camera. Ooh. Yeah, so these are the lips that I'm rocking today. And you can try something bright. You can probably use a little bronze or, you know, work it up, um, work your way up. And that's about it. I challenge you today to embrace what you have, whether it's big eyes, big lips, big nose, some contouring, do a smoky eye, do some bright lipstick, and let me know how it went. I hope you guys enjoyed this. Bye bye. I'm sure you all noticed I have a new camera, finally. I've had it a little while now, but I had some problems with my memory card or whatever. I have it now so it's all good um i have to say hi to everybody that i've met in the mark store and everywhere else telling me you know i've subscribed to you leticia um oh my gosh um afro tea i had a list oh my gosh it's been a lot of you and i just want to say thanks for subscribing thanks for keeping up with me and stay tuned bye <laughs>